engineers you're welcome to the part two of today's video so today i will be talking about the meaning of all these plugs right you have seen that we have four plugs here so today i will be talking about the meaning of all these plugs right so with that time wasted let me start right here you can see this battery is outside this is because my meter have an issue so that's why you see me connecting the battery outside but anyway I will try as much as possible to buy a new multimeter. Engineers, right here we have three symbols. So the first one right here, which is the V, the V means voltage, right? Why this one means ohms, and the last one, which is the diode sign, is stand for a diode, right? So I will be explaining all of this today. So make sure you pay attention to this video. Engineers, first of all, let me start with explanation. The first sign right here that you're seeing is called a diode. You may ask, Father Joe, what is the meaning of a diode? A diode is a component that allowed current to flow only on one direction. You may ask, Father Joe, what is ohms? So let me talk about ohms. First of all, let me explain the meaning of ohms. Ohms is a unit of electrical resistance. I hope you understand. A unit of electrical resistance the resistance of a wire the resistance of a resistor and the resistance of any connection right okay ohms is just a resistance right how far or how close how far and how close is the resistance engineers take for example you want to know the resistance of this wire if you set your multimeter to continuity you will not be able to get the accurate ohms, the resistance of this wire. Because the point that you are setting your multimeter to is not for what you are testing, right? Okay, for you to get the exactly reading, you need to set your multimeter to ohms so that you can be able to read and know the exactly ohms resistance of this multimeter probe, right? If you have any question, you can ask me in the comment section. Okay, so let me explain voltage, which is the V, right? The V stands for voltage, right? Let me show you what I mean. Okay. Right here, you can see the V stands for voltage. Check this out. The V stands for voltage. Okay. You may ask, Father Joe, what is a volt? Let me explain the meaning of volt. Volt simply means a force of an electric current. Volt means a force of an electric current. Let me know in the comment section if you have any question. For you to be able to test a voltage, you need to plug your multimeter probe to the first plug that you're saying V, ohms, and diode, right? Check this out. You need to plug here. Let me show you something, right? This is positive and this is negative, right? So if you want to test it, make sure that your negative of your multimeter probe goes to the battery negative and the positive of your multimeter probe goes to the battery positive so that you will know the exactly voltage of what you're testing right make sure before you test any voltage make sure you first of all understand the voltage first if it is ac voltage make sure that you set your multimeter to ac voltage right if it is dc voltage make sure that you set your multimeter to dc voltage so that you will not spoil your multimeter so this face plug right here is for positive if you have any question in the comment section let me know the part three of this video is coming very soon